So um, let's just talk, I guess, and ask questions about each other. I think that's the objective here. So what do you like to do? Because I'll tell you what I like to do. One of the things I love doing is travel. I have been to, let's see, I have been to 32 states, Spain, Amsterdam, New Zealand, the Bahamas. You know what would be fun right now? We should totally play truth or dare. Emphasis on truth. I'm sorry if I'm being kind of weird or awkward tonight. I don't go on a lot of dates um, because I, I don't like to invest into people who I don't think will benefit me in any way. Uh, it just kind of feels like a waste of time. No, a waste isn't the right word there. So what do you want to talk about? I, I could talk about anything, literally, and whatever interests you. I know a lot about so many different things. <laughs> you, you will not be bored talking with me. I know that this is only our first date, but um, I, I'd like to take this slow. Um, I have a commitment thing. I, the reason why I like being single is because I like going about life with a sense of new possibilities, you know? Why is it so hard for people nowadays to just go on a date and just be open with one another? Just be real. Why is that so hard? Hi. You know what I'd like to do right now is talk about practical ways that you and I can grow closer to one another. And this brings us to question 24. Are your teeth naturally straight or did you have braces as a child? I'm sorry, I, I haven't been on a date in a while. Why, you may ask, is that the case? Well, I, I don't believe in going out with just anybody. Um, I, I believe that it should be someone who you truly believe is the one for you. So you, you should consider that a compliment. <laughs> I love how we're just clicking, you know? Do you feel it? I feel it too. It's like this chemistry between us. It just feels so natural. I hope you don't mind me being direct and honest with you. Um, because look, I, I just need to know whether this thing here has the potential to keep going. I, I, I think you understand that, right? Look, I want to be transparent here with you. Uh, whenever I go on a date, oh, and you probably know what I'm talking about. There's that awkward tension, which we're both trying to suppress by making lame jokes and essentially just talking about our jobs, career, or plans we have in life. And we both know what's happening underneath all this, as we're trying to see a glimpse of what's inside each other, or if we'd be a good match. But that's difficult to do because we're both on our guards to not seem vulnerable or needy of human affection. So... I'd like to just put all that aside for tonight and just be genuine, if you don't mind. Would you like me to get you another cup of marriage? I mean coffee. You know, since we're on a date, I thought it'd be appropriate to mention that recently I've been thinking a lot about this idea of being in love. I've just been enamored by it. <laughs> get it? being in love with the idea of being in love. <laughs> it's just a little joke. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. Whew. Well, um, th this was really fun. It, it was really nice talking to you. Um, but un unfortunately, I have to get going. Um, I have another date tonight, but it was it. But we, we should do this again sometime. Talk to you later. It feels so natural, you know? Is that just me? No. <laughs> so what do you want to talk about? Uh, we, we 